Choose the cam underscore profile dot CSV file from the working directory. Change the component to X value. Change to Y and select Y underscore value as component. Repeat the same for Z. Right click on the markers icon to add a marker. Create a marker with the name reference underscore curve. Click OK. Choose cam for parent body. Choose cam CG as origin point for the marker. Right click on advanced joints. Add an advanced joint with name PTCV. Activate Create Explicit Graphics and click OK. For Body 1 choose Lifter. Choose Lifter underscore top as the point. Choose the curve cam underscore profile for curve. Choose reference underscore marker as reference marker. Create a spring damper system by right clicking on the spring damper icon. Name the system as spring damper. Click OK. Choose Retainer Upper as Body 1 and Retainer Lower as Body 2. Choose Spring Underscore Upper as Point 1 and Spring Underscore Lower as Point 2. We will now add explicit graphics to the spring damper system. Right click on the graphics icon to create graphics. Change graphics type to spring and label it as spring underscore damper. Select Spring Damper as Parent. Choose Spring Underscore Upper as Point 1 and Spring Underscore Lower as Point 2.
Right-click on the motion icon to add motion to the system. Select the joint crank underscore shaft underscore cylinder. A rotational displacement will be applied on this joint. Change motion type to rotational from translational. Go to properties. Change the input type to expression. Enter 10 times pi times time as expression as shown. Save the model and go to run panel. Save the analysis to a working directory before you start analysis. Click Run to start the analysis. Open the animation file in Hyperview. Observe the mechanism of the cam and valve spring. Thank you for watching the video.